Hey guys, what's up? It's one and only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to an episode of Let's Build a City. I am driving our ice cream van at the moment because I've just finished a delivery. Today we're going to be back here working more on the shop floor, the aesthetics of the shop floor now. We've done all of these sort of mechanical stuff. Whoops, in we come. Slower down that spot right there. Yeah, yeah sort of perfect. <laughs> Brakes need a, a little bit of a tightening in there for sure. Uh, I haven't really done anything. Oh, let's get the uh, splash potion. But I have put a ceiling on and just raised the walls up. Just blank because I don't really know where I'm going with. And I don't like to do it without you guys. Um, I've moved the signs so I still know where everything is. So this is still goods in with the office in there. Behind here is still the staff room. And the loading zone is behind that one, but we need to figure out some doorways. And then this one is still storage. So I put the walls up and I put the ceiling on just to give us a sort of an idea on what height I would want it to be. We need a ramp to get or stairs or something to get in here because this is an insane sort of climb to get up into this factory. That's why we have all the loading zones. We've got one on this side and then you can also loop around in the back here. There's like a little back zone look, hey? How cool is that? Well, that's frustrating, isn't it? Why didn't I notice that on the outside? <laughs> do I do that? Is that what I do? I'm not going to do that for now. <laughs> and then this is the uh, the back of the loading. Um, the only trouble that we've got is that unless I do it exactly there, uh, I can't really get a doorway in but that could work as a doorway once we get the floor on the only other thing i done nothing really important is i dropped down this little mono stable circuit by one block literally just dropped it down by one block so then i can have a floor down and when this block goes up it doesn't move the the block above it was here before which means when it went up it'd be on the same level as the floor and therefore breaking the floor however right i like this i like this sort of horseshoe over the top of the contraption now i just done it originally here didn't we ages ago just to sort of cover it up but i sort of like the idea of having loads and loads of different colors of those in wool or clay depending on what uh, we have available so we've got yellow orange white could work cyan could work even though it's not my favorite the blue could work brown maybe it goes with the bricks green red and gray is as far as wool goes that's what i've got now i know there are more wool colors but as you can see purple wool magenta wool lime wool and pink wool are my roadblocks you would have known that if you've watched it for a little while now um that's how i done the roads in the city so what i want to do here is uh, i've already got blue there so let's use i don't know orange here so i want to cover up things that are going to be sort of awkward to design tidy up but what i don't want to do is put blocks in any spot that might mess up redstone um because we've got to remember that that redstone can pass through blocks and i think we're okay here i don't think it's going to do anything with these droppers it being there i'll tell you what we can do we can turn it on we need to move this on switch on off switch probably somewhere on here and we need to move that button as well put to somewhere on a wall as well okay yeah if we get that that let's get i don't know green up on this one now i think it'd be actually quite cool maybe if we make them into squares so we have this um, under here and then It gives your eyes, it'll give it'll give our eyes a focus point to look at. See, I think that looks so cool up there. Let's get, I don't know, red one on here. Ah, little awkward one here, because if I put the block here, it's going to actually block off that redstone. And I need that redstone to go into that block. So let's put that there, put that on the same delay put this here that there uh, here I don't know if that's going to mess up the timing um, and then 
but that doesn't need to be there anymore, which means that doesn't need to be anymore, which means that can go there, which means the block that I wanted, which I've got rid of, can go there. Let's just check to make sure nothing messed up on that, because there is another repeat that I can do there. <laughs> that would be a messy situation to be in. Okay. Well, I don't think I'm going to use the round. So I can put that there now. And I can have this go up. And over the top of these lights. And down this side. Now, do I also want it going down on this one as well? That could be pretty cool. Okay, we'll, just, we'll have to tidy up once, we're, once we've got a sort of an idea planned out. But uh, it really rendered splash. Wow, that is so dark. Okay, uh, so we've got that one. And then maybe... Yellow. Maybe yellow for this one. But how do I want to do this one? Do I want to do it... It'd be quite cool to have it on the floor like this. And then have it come up. Nah. I think I'm gonna put it on this layer. And I'm gonna I'm gonna make like a little pyramid. It doesn't like we don't have to go hyper realistic. We're not obviously with this ice cream factory going like with a realistic factory or, or production line of first it has to do this and then it has to do this. Uh, we're not really bothered about that. We just want to make something look really, really cool, basically. That's the idea. Okay, I can't go any further here. Uh, this is going to be a little bit tricky. This is our... It's a bit of a poor finish, really. This is where our ice cream is. Where is the ice cream? There. Why is it there? Surely it would be in there. Unless something has messed up. Um, it should always be in the chest, right? And that runs off that lever down here. But it's a little bit of um, a cheaty way to finish. That looks quite cool there with that sort of pyramid thing. Oh, yeah. It is, it is not reaching all the way. There we go. That should, that should be fine now once they go. I think I need to put... Where are they all? There we go. And they should then stay in the chest. The only reason why they went out of the chest is because the hopper pulled them out when the power went out. But that should... Oh, what a noise. <laughs> now I'm on top. Okay. Uh, for floor, let's get a floor sort of thing going. We'll worry about that later on. We'll work out a, a better finish. A more sort of pristine finish later on. Let's get the ideas down though. Um, I would really actually like to go really wacky and keep this rainbow thing or this multicolored thing. It's a magical Willy Wonka ice cream factory. We've got to make it look cool. So let's let's get clay, I think, because it's a cleaner, smoother block for a floor. But we'll grab some blocks that are similar. So maybe we can go with that. Maybe go with a pink, a green. A pink and I want one more color I've already got orange maybe a, a cyan just to neutral neutralize it out and although this is gonna be incredibly annoying to for me to do I'll do it off camera I think I want this As the floor in here, I think it's so wacky, but so cool. Um, it's hard to figure it out until you get it going. And I want that to repeat throughout. I think those three colours would be quite nice. They 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 look delicious, <laughs> uh, but I think it's a different enough colour to uh, to go through. So that's going to be the floor. And then for the ceiling, just getting some stuff to do off camera. Obviously, I think a nice bit of coving around the side. Actually, maybe a little bit of black coving could do well. The black on white, I think it'll just sort of neaten everything up a little bit. And, you know, that might do for the moment because we don't really know how we're connecting all of this top part up. 
So uh, let me have a little bit of work off camera and I shall be back. How cool is this floor looking? Really? Actually doesn't look that bad, does it? Let's just tell you something. Again. I had this on while I was off camera because this final part I couldn't hide up the redstone. I've hidden that, so that's all nicely and closed off now. Love the floor, really, really do. Uh, but I think I've had a better idea on how we can do this last part, a little bit simpler as well. I think if we place a little dropper that goes up, and then we have a couple of hoppers and a chest we can have the chest here that hopper there and that hopper there and now we should only i'm hoping need to do one i could even put a double chest there to make it look a little bit more impressive once we hide it all up like i can have a i don't know wool what one didn't we use cyan or brown i use brown terrible color So we can do something like that to have a look at this chest at the end. I might even do something like that and then just have chests above it. I can fill them up with ice cream if need be. Get that one. Get that one. And now I'm hoping that quite, quite simply that would work actually. So it, it puts it into that hopper, which puts it into that chest. And then that one takes it back out and puts it into that hopper. So in fact, I should probably... Oh no, it's just going to... Oh, they're not going to filter out. Why don't they filter out of there? Because that hopper is locked because this is powered? I don't know. Not quite sure. Yeah. Really I've moved the button. I've done the button on this side. It's now on that wall that I just need to sort of mark it up. It does work, but I think they all went into there. So if we get ourselves some diamond horse armor. And maybe. Can I like squeeze? The more we get in there. I think I need to fill up like. A load uh, a couple of hoppers or something i want to start seeing them in the chest basically i think that should work if i put those in there i don't know if it'll do anything no if i just fill up all the spots and then have a couple like this I think that looks better. It now looks like we're sort of always refilling ice cream in here now. And we've got that nice surround on there. That works really well. That I'm happy with. I'm not going to worry about the ceiling at the moment because I don't really know how it's all going to tie together. Like how we're going to do this next part. Do we ignore the windows, for example? And... And I would really like the brick to be on this level, yeah? But we've got a couple of bits of redstone. We've got redstone in the way we're I think we're just going to have to be a little bit um, accepting, maybe is the word, in some places. And just sort of go with what we can do. Um, if I go up like that. I don't really want to be able to see that glass, so I think I'll hide that up. And we just sort of, we, we sort of just do what we can. Maybe even that could be on top of here. This night vision is crazy. I need to just do the command that just like gives me like night vision permanently or something like that. I don't think I really mind all that much. Yeah, you know what? That's actually going to look quite cool. I don't even mind some of them being set back and some of them being set forward. Maybe if I was really worried, I could just bring this wool forward by another block. And, <laughs> and have it like that. It's a little bit annoying. Oh no, I suppose I can go in here now. 
And then that hides up those redstones and those dispensers. A little bit of glass there. Doesn't need to be glass. I think I want that brick to go up here. Sometimes you want like the colour stuff to stick out. But I think in this case, if we're making if them all flush, we want to make sure that they're, they're as much all flush as they can be. Um, so we don't have some sticking out and some not. This is actually tying to bet, tying to better, tying together better than I thought it would. And then this ice crusher one, let's grab a wand, because I don't like placing blocks. Uh, we'll do that one. Oop. Um, hmm. Oh no, that's okay. And then, because the bricks can run along here, can't they? To hide that stuff. And then... Um, this, I, I, I put that there as a test, but it could, if he wanted to, be underground. Or we just do that, which I think is probably better. I cannot place blocks today. So, at the time of recording this, the UK still is in lockdown. I don't know if by the time this goes out, if we're still in lockdown. So, let me know in the comments section if, if you are or not. I obviously record uh, ahead of schedule so I can just get stuff done. And, and oops. Uh, and, and I don't like to be sort of stuck on a specific um, schedule. So, like, if I'm feeling the mood to record, I'll record, like, a couple of videos, a week or two's worth of videos, and I sort of just chill out and, uh, and enjoy my time again. But, um, yeah, so, so at the moment, I'm actually, uh, I'm actually still in isolation. It's going okay for me, actually. I'm, in, uh, I'm actually enjoying it. I'll, it's, it's not too bad. I know some people are finding it a lot harder than me, so uh, I'm, I'm happy about that. So we managed to hide up a little bit there. I can still see that bit here, but I don't think I can actually do anything about that. I could put that, oops, a brown block there, not that it really makes a difference. Uh, and that button I need to, to dress up a little bit better. This was before we started the episode. I'll put that in there. I saw air there, or oh, I saw sky. Where did I see that? Does it make a difference that I changed the block? Does that, is that going to be noticeable? Probably not. I could probably just keep that like that. I'm not, not too worried. Still need to get the staircase in here. Feeling a lot better though. Do I don't think I want red going in between all of those as well. Or we put the red at this level. And we really sink it back. Um, I can't get in there. I think it would look better as a different colour. Let's just see what it looks like like this. I think that's going to be a little bit too much red. Yeah, okay. Um, well, how about a pillar block? Like a, a quartz pillar block going up in between. Like this. Let's have a look at this. This could work. Yeah, I think it does. So this part, what we can do is we can flick the lever, and quite simply, the light comes on to that one. Oh, I should probably put the blocks behind these pistons, though, so I, can, so I can't see that one in. Now, how am I going to do this? Um, do I use red? I'd probably use red. I think I just got to do that, right? That should be that should be good, shouldn't it? Just leave that hole there. Oh, I should really do it down a block as well because of the um, the bottom half of that piston isn't a full block, is it? You see. And again, I don't think I think we've we're pretty lucky here. The way I done this little simple redstone, um, it doesn't get in the way of either of those blocks. Get through here. Yeah, 
much needed. So I can do that one. I can do that one. I can do that one. And we choose the flavoring of our ice cream. We can even have multiple flavors. Strawberry and chocolate flavored ice cream in one. Okay. I think all in all, I'm feeling pretty good about how it's going to lay out. Um, I want door to storage. I might even actually put a warehouse door in here. Like that. Get some court stairs. It'll always be shut. But I think it would be nice to have. I know I've got the garage doors from uh, Melissa's, Molasses Stores or whatever it is. Um, I don't want to use it. I like this. I like using stairs for this sort of thing. And that nice sort of bigger one at the top. I like that. And then we'll have the door to actually get into the storage here. That hides that up. Uh, that lever, where can I move that lever to? Can I move that lever to there somewhere? That would be nice. Anywhere along here, right along this line here, preferably. Um, I th think, I think that'll do it. What, what was it there? Not that one. Nope. Oh, it's because the other lever's on, isn't it? It's because that lever's on there. Really. Hey! Is that on the back? Perfect. So, I really want down to be on, though, don't we? And we want up to be off, like a light switch. Um, so, that's easy enough to do. We'll just grab a torch. And we'll swap this piece of redstone here with the torch. And that should do it. So we've got on. So it's getting shaken up. And the milk, yeah, you can see how the milk gets fired out there. We get the sugar added there. We get choose what color we want here. And then we crush it up and we add the ice. <laughs> and we get our ice cream. Beautiful, we've actually lost one out of there. Maybe an employee took it or something like that. Uh, I should really put these like that as well. Yeah, okay, cool. I like it. What other ideas should we have on the shop floor? Do we build... Uh, it would have to be a tiny little forklift if we was going to build a forklift. Why would you have a forklift in here, though? You wouldn't... Well, I don't know. You probably would for goods in and stuff. Can I build a tiny, tiny forklift? Now, I know Corallus actually quite recently has built some forklifts on Hermitcraft server. Um, but I don't know if I can... I, I've got to build on a smaller scale than that. We're going to have to make this up as we go. Okay. Um, that's really as big of a footprint as I could go. Would I want it there, though? I think I want it pointing that way. Ooh, 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 lag spike. We do something like that. We'll grab some buttons. What What was that? A broken buff bottle. Ah. We'll put some uh, little wheel hubs on here. Now, actually, ooh, that's wrong. The forklift that I have at my work is a three-wheeler like that. So maybe I can do that. It'll make it a little bit smaller, maybe. Um, what colour do we want it? Uh, my fork. What colour is my forklift? Yellow. I think it's yellow. Um, I haven't been, been at work for <laughs> so long. I've sort of forgotten what colour it is. Um, actually, it's getting very, very tall already. Um, that's that's actually surprisingly tall. This is the the hardest part about making vehicles is um, is getting the scale right, getting it to look okay. Maybe I could just go with grey instead. Uh, let's grab some walls. That sort of works. Can I get? I I don't know if I can place trapdoors. I know. You could now in my in how Minecraft is now, but at this version, I can't place trapdoors anywhere. I have to place them on a block. So again, 
I think I'm going to have to go with the slabs. Like that. Do I put that there? Maybe I put that there. Maybe I put it there and there, in fact. Okay, that's a start of a forklift. I need some kind of... Um, I need some kind of fence or, 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 or something. Let's try and get that yellow back in it. I would really like a bit of yellow clay in there. Maybe like that. With a different slab, maybe, with a white one. That could work. That could work. Yeah, okay, we've got a cute, uh, that's a, uh, a quaint little um, uh, forklift truck. We'll stick uh, a couple of doors on, like that, so we can get in. We'll stick a stair. I think that one's probably better, black one. It'd be like um, a little plastic chair or something like that. It's on the way up. Yes, we'll put a lever as a little controller or like for the forks and stuff like that, you know, all that jazz. And then on the back here, I want an item frame. I want a block of redstone. For a little tail light on the back there and then up here we'll grab some snowballs as oops that's levers no i just <laughs> fired off oh i needed that item frame <laughs> that's pretty cool uh, i'd like a, maybe a ladder actually a ladder there could work very well yeah you know what i actually really like that as a t as a really small forklift design I, I maybe even dropping this down it might make it look a little bit smaller i think that looks cuter and also it gives me the opportunity just to put one snowball one light on the front here um it matches that sort of cyclops back that we've got as well yeah i think that's cute i think, I think that's, that's quite a, a quaint little yeah oops stop throwing snowballs jesus okay i like that uh, i'm gonna leave it there we're not done i actually wanted to get this done today but it, it took a lot longer than i thought we've got everything in place now all the buttons there you go fire them uh, all the buttons are in place the walls are up a little bit of tidying to do with the with the top here i'd like to have some more furniture some crates some barrels and stuff but we still have and i wasn't planning to do this anyway we've still got the storage area uh goods in the office uh, there's still a little bit more work to do here but this is the part that i was worried about tying it all together into something coercive uh which is what we've got so if you enjoyed it Hit that like button if you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe and we shall see you in the next episode.